Tribune. Mike, the Canucks made a point of getting tougher in the offseason. They've got Hortachuk, O'Brien, and Ripon in the lineup tonight. What are you expecting? Well, toughness is no good on paper, Scott. They've got to prove it in front of a home team. They've been talking to talk about toughness all summer. Now they have to go out and prove it against a team that won't roll over. The Calgary Flames, never short of tough guys. Kelly, is Mika Kiprasov under some pressure to burst out of the starting gate tonight? You know what? A lot of this is all blown out of proportion, if you ask me, because he his game did slip just a little bit last year, but I think it's more about his team play and everybody has to be more committed to team defense and that includes the coaching staff there has to be a lot more structure in their game all right stand by the next voice you hear will be pa announcer john ashbridge to take us through the celebration of the life of luke bordon starting in goal your vancouver Canucks captain for 2008 2009 roberto luongo Ladies and gentlemen, this past summer, the Vancouver Canucks lost a family member, Luke Bourdon. Tonight, we celebrate his life and honor his memory. Luke had a great sense of humor and an unparalleled passion for the game. He was kind, he was generous. As an example, last year he made an anonymous donation of $10,000 to the Minor Hockey Association in his hometown of Shippigan, New Brunswick, to help families who could not otherwise afford equipment. Luke was a loving son, a hero to his hometown, and a teammate whom no one will ever forget. Luke's passion, courage, and perseverance serve as a living legacy, but perhaps more importantly, his character reminds us all that with hard work and dedication, a dream can come true. Tonight, please join us in celebrating Luke's life and welcoming his family. Luke's mother, Suzanne Boucher, Luke's grandmother, Florence Boucher. Luke's uncle and aunt, Robert and Ida Boucher. And Luke's girlfriend, Charlene Ward. Would you please also welcome Canuck season ticket holder, Candace McFarland. She and her boyfriend, Tommy Duranja, were the recipients of Luke's jersey from the last regular season home game when the Canuck players presented their fans with the jerseys off their back. At this time, we'd like to ask Canuck captain Roberto Luongo, along with Luke's closest teammate, Alex Burroughs, to join Candace in the presentation of Luke's last game worn jersey to his family. legacy will never be forgotten and in honor of Luke's memory each Canuck player will wear a special LB emblem on their helmets for the remainder of this season Time Juno Award winner, Music Hall of Famer, and Order of Canada recipient, recording artist Tom Cochran, accompanied by Kenny Greer from Red Rider, in this special tribute, a celebration of the life of our friend and teammate, Luke Bourdon. Up at five, 
Take shots till he make the thing drag. Out of school, that back on us. That was his life in the big league. He was gonna play in the big league. Sounds like thunder as it rips through my back. Sometimes in the morning I'll still hear the sound. I sweet smell. Can't you drop me down to the big league? Ladies and gentlemen, would you please remain standing? Would you please join?